welcome back friends uh, in our last class uh, we have discussed about jQuery UI selectable function so in this class we are going to change this we will discuss about sort evil function so here inside the body tag you can just uh, copy all this main diff you can copy and just come here and paste one more time so we are giving this uh, the name main2 and you can just uh, come inside css and you can just uh, duplicate this one i have just added here a floor left you can add also press ctrl plus d to duplicate this and this just main two so for both of these you have used id for this one also and for this one also so you can just save this uh, go to run menu launch in chrome and you can see now you have just uh, to to div here so you know you can just come inside your script tag or jquery so you can just uh, make this sortable so you can just insert a dot a dollar sign round bracket another dot another round bracket semicolon and inside single quotation uh, we are going to select uh, id or main so here you are just writing sort able so you can just save this now you can come here and refresh now you can see it is just sortable you can just move this till here like this you can just move this now it is sortable so but for this one it is not sortable because we have not added this here if you want to add so you can just put a comma here and you can put another hash sign main2 we are going to add this also so inside this uh, with curly braces uh, we are just going to use uh, another one this is called connect with this is an attribute so you are just writing here co double n e c t connect with so you are just uh, giving the value uh, connect with uh, inside the single quotation we are giving and here now you are using hash sign for example the first main and comma another hash sign main2 so just save this and let's check refresh so you can see now this also movable you can see you can just move this from here so you can just move this here here just like this you can just move so now this just movable uh, we have just used here we have added both of the main or you can say id and we have just uh, used sortable even here to make this sortable so you can just add uh, you can add a comma here for just adding second attribute so we can just use here something like plus plse placeholder so for using placeholder uh, you need to just create another class so for the name for example the name of class should be shadow so you need to just come inside css you are creating another class dot shadow dot shadow open curly braces and uh, i'm just saying the background should be you can give any background i'm just giving black color and you can give border for this border 1px solid now you can give any color i'm just using here white color and after that you can give a width for this width for example you can give 120 pixel the same like uh, just uh, select and height i'm just giving 30 pixel as we given here for the select one here and uh, what can you do i'm just using margin margin 10 pixel you can save and just come here refresh now you can see the element you are you want to just move or sort here uh it's background color it's just looking empty with black color and white water so you can just want to place here you can see it's just looking like this so it was about this uh, we can use one more attribute so this card 
uh, drop on empty so you are just writing here drop on e -M -P -T -Y, empty so you can just set this false by default it is just uh, true so you can put this false control s so what is the usage of this uh, for example if you want to just uh, uh, if you are moving these elements to inside this box all of the elements so you can see you can move from this box to the second box for example from first box to the second box we can move but when you want to just move them back in the first box box so you cannot just move this uh, let's check drop on empty should be false and I don't know why it's not working false so just save this refresh so it's just working here what's the problem drop on empty so just make this on capital drop on empty control s to save now come here and refresh you can just draw from this box to this box from first box to the second box you are just dropping or sorting you can see so now you can just move so you cannot move you can see so if you are just going to make this true so after that you can move from this box to the current box or the first box for example true so it's by default true now you can see uh, I think we have not saved and just refresh move this move this back here so you can see it's working you can move all of them here and this one this one this one and this one now just move back them here you can see it is you can move them so it's working correctly So it was just about the Acuity UI sortable function. Like this, you can create uh, element sortable. You can move uh, from one place to another place and you can just move them back. So this is the coding, you can see. Uh, we have just used connect with property. We have just connect these uh, two elements together. You can just move from here to there and from there to here, you can see. We have used connect with property and placeholder we have just added a class uh, for example you can see this class background is black border is white you can see we have just used a placeholder by the help of a placeholder we add a class here and drop on empty if you want to just make this false so control s you cannot just uh, if you move this element to here so you cannot just move move them back so this, this is just the usage of drop empty so for this class it is enough uh, we have just discussed about uh, sortable so watch the video and do practice have a nice time and see you